Because I was hit by Mr. Sanderson and he was at fault, I assumed that Eric, who was our ski instructor who was there at the time, who was overseeing the event, he said, I'm going to leave all of your information. And he said, you should go ski down because my kids were waiting for me. Oscar-winning actress Gwyneth Paltrow on the stand today. No, it's not some movie. It's part of a civil lawsuit over a ski collision. Happened back in 2016 in Park City, Utah resort called Deer Valley. We'll get to the importance of Deer Valley uh, in a minute. Terry Sanderson, retired optometrist and veteran, sued Paltrow for $3 million. Judge later said he can only collect $300,000. Sanderson says Paltrow hit him from behind and then skied off. The judge says there's no evidence that she left. Sanderson says the crash left him with traumatic brain injuries. Paltrow argues it was actually Sanderson who ran into her, so she countersued for a dollar plus attorney's fees. Sam Rubin's here, News Nation Entertainment reporter, multiple Emmy awards under his belt. Uh, all right, Sam, she's a great actress. Do we believe what she's saying on the stand? That is the $1 question or $300,000 question, depending on what uh, judge and jury think. This is a she skied, he skied incident where uh, she was asked when Paltrow was uh, by the plaintiff's attorneys, does she understand the rules of uh, skiing at Park City? Among the rules is that in the event of a collision, uh, you're supposed to stay at the scene of the accident. She said she did not understand the rules, was not aware there were particular rules. And she said her mentality was such, she wasn't so much worried about uh, the gentleman who ran into her, as she was worried about herself. She's saying she is the victim here. And the only reason yeah. this whole thing is taking place is because you and I and everybody watching knows her name and knows who she is. She thinks this is a fishing expedition because she's a wealthy and famous person. Well, a fishing expedition or a gold digging exp expedition, depending on how you uh, how you look at it. And she indicated that it may not have even been an accident by this other gentleman. Uh, take a look to her talking about her version of the crash. I was skiing and two skis came between my skis, forcing my legs apart. And then there was a body pressing against me and there was a very strange grunting noise. So my brain was trying to make sense of what was happening. I thought, am I, is this a practical joke? Is someone like doing something perverted? This is really, really strange. My mind was going very, very quickly and I was trying to ascertain what was happening. And ascertain what was happening at one of the most or the most expensive ski resort in the world, Deer Valley, uh, where they limit the number of lift tickets and do not allow snowboarders. So there can be no shenanigans of, of any type. Is there any independent cooperation to either one of these two stories? Not as of yet. We haven't heard from Eric, the fabled ski instructor. Also, to be called to the stand and testify early next week are her children, who were minors when this took place. Uh, they are not minors now. They uh, presumably were down the hill when this took place, but they are on the expected witness list. So again, at the, at the moment, it is two individual uh, depictions of an accident. And uh, Gwyneth Paltrow, and this is uh, testimony for the first time, saying, "Hey, wait a minute! I didn't run into him. He ran into me." Yeah, uh, we're, we're looking at we're looking at pictures of her in court. I um, mean, she's been trolled all all the time about what her glasses and how she looks and her smirk and and on and on and on. You live you live out in L.A. with all these fancy important people. Um, do they have to worry about this sort of constant gold digging? expeditions oh this person ran into me this person tripped me on a sidewalk uh, this person uh, ran into me at a bar blah 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 uh three most important words uh in southern california uh umbrella liability insurance a lot of people take out insurance and they're a well-known person just for that that they might be sued for things that they have nothing to do with mm -hmm because people often equate notoriety with wealth, not that the two necessarily go together. In Brennan Paltrow's case, they do go together. Yeah, very, very, very good, uh, very good point. Sam, uh, we appreciate it. Uh, it. It's interesting, people are already texting me uh, on, on which team they're on. Uh, so far, Gwyneth, uh, Team Paltrow's winning in, in my unofficial uh, poll here of friends watching. So we'll watch next week together and uh, discuss. Thank you, sir. You bet. Thanks for watching. Go to NewsNationNow.com to find NewsNation on your television provider. And don't forget to subscribe. Click the red button to get more of NewsNation's fact-driven, unbiased coverage.